Welcome back, everybody, to Seven Days to Die on the Undead Legacy mod. I'm an old guy gaming in, in this episode, we are going to continue our random and somewhat systematic looting of the northeastern city. Um, I, is this the, this is the POI that we just very recently did, isn't it? Where we climb up the trellis and start from the roof, or is this a different POI? Um, yeah. Yeah, you know what? I think we're going to skip this one only because we just very recently did it. So let's, let's, uh, move on to something that's a little fresher uh, than that. Um, before we get started in earnest, too, uh, I need to announce to you guys that I am going to take what will hopefully be my final week-long business trip um, until next October. So I'm I'm going to be gone um, the first week in May uh, on business, and I will not be able to... Didn't we just recently do that POI too? I think we did. So let's move on to this next house. Uh, yeah, so I'll be gone all next week. Um, and uh, while away, I won't be able to, uh, of course, make videos or anything like that. Uh, but when I get back, which is going to be around May 8th, I believe, um, then I won't have to travel again, at least not for a week, until October. Uh, and should be able to get back to a normal schedule. And hopefully Alpha 21 is going to be... You know out by the time I get back um, or at least getting you know getting close to to be it out so that we can start Alpha 21 looking forward to it um and I I've mentioned to you guys too that uh, I am most likely will end this series uh, when Alpha 21 comes out um, because, you know, I mean, there's more that we can do, but I think we've we've given it a good run. I mean, shoot, we're on, we're well over 100 episodes. I don't even know. We're actually, we're, I think we're approaching 200 episodes, aren't we? I'll have to look. I don't know. So we'll keep going in Undead Legacy, and we'll get as far as we can until Alpha 21 comes out. Uh, but then when it does, we will switch to 21 and start a whole new series, and it should be pretty interesting. All right, anyway, let's go ahead and get started here with some more random looting. Uh, we are looking for research data more than anything. Uh, but, you know, of course, anything else that we come across, including uh, decent fat loots, if such a thing actually exists, I don't know. <laughs> Most of the time it's crap. Or not crap, but, well, sometimes it's crap, yeah. Um, but sometimes it's just not... Uh, proportionate to what it should be based upon what you have to go through to get to it. Um, but that's just the way it works, I guess, in this game. Alright, so let's head on in here. We've got a irradiated nurse. Sure, whether is someone here? Yeah. Oh, Roberta, you need to move out of the way. Thank you. Okay. Man, I really like this shotgun. Oh, that door's broken. Let's help Steve out here. Steve and his popping head. All right. Check the sink there. Uh, we should be hitting these pictures because you never know what's behind them. A bandage. Oh, there's an irradiated big mama. Um, let's get a sniper shot off on her. Anybody in here? Nope. They probably would have jumped out if there would have, would have been someone in there. Alright, so we go through here. 
I haven't been in this house in a long time. I don't even recognize it. Sneaky shotgun shot. Oh, shit. Oh, that is not good. I think that's M60 time. Come at me, bros and girls and sisters. There we go. Easy as pie. Blueberry pie, because this is seven days to die. And I wouldn't lie, because I'm not shy. <laughs> okay, I'll stop. Oh my goodness. Can't take me anywhere. Nothing behind there. Oh, you scared me, Roberta. Rumble? Ah, we're going to get some ceiling action here, I think. Is that two blocks high or just one block high? Oh, it's just one block high. So maybe a crawler might drop down on our head, but normal zombies can't fit up there. Yeah, I do not recognize this house. Chances are very good that I've I have done it once or twice before, but it's Oh, uh, look at that. Skill point. Uh it's definitely not familiar to me. Um let's go look let's look at that for a second. We are Uh let's see. Yeah, we got one perk point there. We are working in the fortitude tree. We got boomstick for pain tolerance for I think we want to do healing factor for next. What does that give us? Restore one hit point every 10 seconds. Critical wounds heal 80% faster. Yeah, let's do that. We're working on making ourselves tougher is what we're doing here. Okay, looks like we're going upstairs. Let's do it. See if we can get her to fall through the floor. No, <laughs> it didn't quite work out. Just for funsies. Hey, hold still. Quit moving your head. This is actually kind of a nice house. It reminds me a little bit of the house that I fixed up in Alpha uh, 20 Vanilla Series. It's not exactly the same, though. That was a really nice house. Yuck. yuck -a -poo. All right, nothing else in here. The door's locked. And into the attic we go with possibly... Oh, I thought it was that other board that would have collapsed. Okay. The one that looked flimsy, but that was not the case. Is it... Hmm, I don't know. All right, let's uh, search these. Can we stand... Oh, no! So it's these ones that we can't stand on. Can we stand over here? Yeah, okay. Oh, that's a fat loot's room. Zombie hiding spot, maybe? All right. We have made it to Le Fat Le Loot's room. Let's see what we got here. Uh, that's good. That's what we're here for. That's good. Nice. 
It's always good when you find a large medical kit. Ooh. That's the same level as the one we currently have. Is it better, though? It does eight more damage. If I'm reading that right. 175, one, what? Yeah, that is an upgrade, ladies and gentlemen. That is amazing. All right, there you go. That was worth the price of admission. For sure. Okay, let's move on to, to the uh to the next place. Just gotta remember how to get out of here. Did we get all the significant stuff in here? I think we did. Not likely there's a wall safe behind here, but you never know. Well, there's something else though. Definitely worth looting. Um, is there anything up in the attic here? Or the rafters? I don't think so. Nothing big, anyway. Okay, this house, I don't believe we've done in a long time. Isn't this the burned out house? I don't know. Let's put a few things away first before we go do that house. This is kind of sort of not good. Oh shit, they're coming. Run away. Yeah, running horde just came through while I was trying to do my inventory management. Okay, well, we're going to have to uh, pick them off. Nice one, OG. Give me my crossbow. Bolt back. These dudes alongside are going to come after me if I start sniping, so we're going to have to deal with them. Come on, Bo. Ooh. Grazed his nose. The first time. The second time I grazed his cranium. And actually, no, that wasn't a graze, in case you didn't realize that. Okay, well, let's start popping some of these guys off. Um, there's a zombie that went down there, so we'll probably get his attention too. Oh, no, he didn't hear that, huh? All right. We are hungry. We're a little thirsty too, so let's take that. And we have an abrasion, so let's take one of these. Okay. Where did all those zombadoodles go? I saw like a big old line of them chasing me. Did they actually despawn? That seems unlikely. I didn't get that far away. Huh. Okay. Well, let's proceed then. Make sure everybody's loaded. We got a construction worker here. All right, how do we get into this place? It's been a long time since I've done this. Oh, probably from here. Hmm. 
Um, maybe not. I mean, I know I can put a block down, and I will if, if I can't figure it out, but... No crossbow bolt. Is this where we go? Well, maybe, maybe we do get in through that garage and I just didn't look closely enough. I mean, we can certainly break that block. I don't really see a way to jump up onto there to get up there because, you know, the roof's in the way. So maybe that's what we're supposed to do is just break this block. The game doesn't usually... <clears throat> have you break stuff to to get through there's usually a, a path somewhere all right so it looks like it wants us to climb up the trellis let's look around the yard first Front door's locked. <clears throat> oh, I never finished my, <clears throat> excuse me, my inventory management, but that's right. Let's just go. Chicken. I'm not going to kill the chicken. All right. There's a light there. And it wants us to go in here. Zombos? No zombos up here? There's one down in there. Oh, you know what? We could probably get a headshot off there. There you go. Did we wake somebody up? No, that's Roberta the robotic drone. Okay, so let's go across here. Um, well, maybe this way first. Nothing significant over here, just the usual stuff. I actually need to not loot all that crap because we just don't have the room for it. I know, I say that all the time, don't I? Okay, drop down here. Make sure you're out and loaded and fight zombies. No? Oh, okay. Definitely need some oil. We're completely out of oil because I've been using it for Molotovs. <laughs> Sent Big Mama through the floor. She's probably not dead, though. Nope. It takes usually takes more than a couple of shots to kill irradiated Big Mama. Ooh, there's some bookshelves in there. Um. Okay, we'll wait for his body to disappear, and then we'll throw a block in there so we can cross over. Um, and just keep an eye on her possibly making it back up here. Doesn't sound like she can get out of wherever she is. Okay. Uh, you know what? I don't care about that. I'm going to scrap it for the stuff. 
We must have blown that hole in there. Medicine cabinet, nice, very nice. That's the room we came out of. Not really seeing anything else in here. No! Oh! I didn't think she was right there. I think we're done with this upper area. Let's head on down. This is the, yeah, that place there. The door's locked. Nothing there. Sambo's in here. No, just some trash. Check the sinks. There's one charge of coffee in there. Here, let's sort this stuff. Uh, we could stand to drink. So what we'll do is this. And then I guess we, we can just use these. It doesn't matter. Okay, time to go downstairs. See the fat loots. We might have already woken up the zombies down here. Well, not all of them. <clears throat> Nothing else in here. There's a decent amount of resources in this place. Oh, we just found an airplane engine. Nice. Oh, shit. Down with the sickness. sure where those other zombos are. Okay. Let's head on into the sewer. I don't think there's anything that way. There's the fat loops. So th this is one of those deals where we jump down and then we get rushed by a bunch of ziggies. I have done this PR before, just not very many times. So let's uh, instead... Oh, where are they going? Is there a way for them to get at us over here? Oh, they... They can't get up here. Uh, well, at least not from that direction. Okay. We'll 
send some of them out. <clears throat> I don't know if they can get to me from some other direction. I just don't remember. All right, well, let's hop hop down, I guess. They all went through that direction. Yeah, that opens up that um, hatch that we were looking at earlier. Oh! Okay. Come on down, zombos. Are they going to come on down? There we go. All right, let's go back down and check out the fat loot skis. There's something in here. No, not really. All right, let's check the weapons bag. A nice high level sledge trail. Oh! I was say, where are you? You're right at my feet. Basic sensors. You know what? We might use that at some point. Tech junkie... Regular power attacks. Stun batons. No, we're not doing stun batons in this playthrough, so I'm not gonna read that. As I've mentioned to you guys before, though, at some point... We should give them, give them a go. All right, let's check the main loot skis here. Wow. Wow. Seriously? It is definitely an upgrade. It's better in every way, except for it has one less in the magazine. And it's an S level. Whoo! Why is it that um, when we finally leave the wasteland and go into the easiest biome, we start finding the good loot? That does not compute. I'm not complaining, mind you. That was a beautiful find, you guys. Absolutely beautiful find. All right. I loved this Vindicator, though. Very cool shotgun, but a spaz, we got to do a spaz, especially an S-level spaz. All right, let's put all this stuff on, and we even have room for another mod slot, too, which, uh, well, actually, did we already have the weapon flashlight on here? Maybe we did. Oh, look at this thing. And it's got a really nice resonating boom to it, too. I just love that. Okay. So we've we've found we've done good. <laughs> we've done really good on the loot so far. I don't know if there's anything up in these uh shelf areas or not. Okay, cool. I'm stoked. So here's what we're going to do. Because uh because this is the last episode I'm going to be able to get to you guys until I return from my trip. Uh we're going to go a little bit longer and let's do one more POI. Um that way we can test out our spaz. Uh, should we do the courthouse? Let's do the courthouse. I'm thinking we should do the courthouse. What is this place? Is this just a like a little garden? Oh, whoops. I meant to aim, and I accidentally hit the fire button at the same time. 
I haven't done the courthouse in a long time. Um, you know what though? Why don't we get our, let's get our aircraft over here. Come on, Bo. Come and meet Spaz. Oh, you're not Bo. Very nice. I'm just, I, I'm kind of looking real quick to see what else is over here. Uh, we've probably done that POI before, I'm sure. Well, I'm not 100% sure. But it looks familiar. Yeah, I'm, I know we've done that POI. It's the one that has the beehives in the backyard. Okay, yeah, let's uh, let's go ahead and do the courthouse, because I haven't done the courthouse. I don't think I've done the courthouse at all in, in Alpha 21. Not that I can recall, anyways. So we'll take our gyro over there so we have it close by. And I will once again uh, try and offload uh, some of the stuff that we have. How come I have no sound on my gyrocopter? What is up with that? <clears throat> oh, you know what? We might be overloaded. Okay. I'm going to have to have a come to Jesus meeting with this inventory. We're not taking back anything that's not absolutely valuable. So let me let me sort that out and then I'll meet you guys over by the courthouse. Okay guys, we're back. I just remembered why I was so heavy. Uh, I had that that plane engine in my inventory. <clears throat> so um we got some zomba doodles off that way. I'm just putting a few more things here in the uh gyrocopter. I want to keep an empty jar with me. And we need to eat again. You know, food's actually going to maybe become an issue. I guess we have some canned food there. Um, I don't want to use canned food, though. Uh, the chicken ration we can eat straight up. And the cat food. These other things, though, we need for the higher-end recipes. Okay. Bring my crossbow bolt back to me, brother. Thank you. Uh, all right, let's go do the courthouse here. Navis Game Police Department, I think is what the NPD stands for. Uh, I'm going to take that. I don't really need a copper coil. I don't think copper coils are used for anything. They're just, you just use them to, whoa, hold that head still. What the hell, man? I, I must have, a, I have a choke on this, right? I do. Okay. Wow. This has, has, um, a, mo a more narrow spread than the, I think the Vindicator did. did that or that was just some. Uh, bad shooting on my part, which, well, we all, we already know that's part of it, right? Oh, wow, look at that find. Yeah, we, we, we can just all agree right now that bad aim, or potato aim as we call it, is definitely part of the situ situation. They say that's going to be super heavy too. Why don't we include that, <clears throat> excuse me, with our our stashed airplane engine in this mailbox and I do have it marked on the map um we might end up needing to cook something so that's why I killed that chicken there's another one too that way at least we'll have a little bit of meat uh, I saw another chicken over here somewhere where is it there it is It's like a massive overkill for killing a chicken, but hey, you got to use what you got. <clears throat> uh, 
<clears throat> okay. Yeah, finding that purple ball in the cop car was not a bad deal at all. Let's do this. I have done this POI before. It's just been a long time. There are th six charges, good lord, of mineral water in those thingies. Um... Okay, let's, um, and I just threw out a bunch of jars, too, to try and consolidate stuff. I don't need any of that crap. In fact, I don't even need the bolts, because those are easy enough to make. All right, well, that's all we have room to do anything with, so. Let's open this. <clears throat> $133. Here's some books. That door's locked. Alright, this is where we get our first rush of Zika Ruskies. Um... I want to say there's more than just one Zombo in there. Check the desks because they can have books and schematics and stuff in them. <clears throat> All right, go through here. That vending machine does not work. Interrogation room with evidence and an orange something. What is it? Oh, it's a pipe rifle. Okay. Or anything in here? Oops. Not really. Steel helmet. Let's unlock this. Give us a schematic, man. We'll take a book. Books are good too. There's a, a weapons bag inside of there. in there <clears throat> got an office with an overturned desk Ooh, look at that let's open it right from the top do we need to go right or left there we go a badger nine nine millimeter rounds okay 
I remember in earlier versions of UDL, that weapon was actually quite, uh, quite powerful. I think it was supposed to be a 38, but it, it did way more damage than it was supposed, than it, yeah, than it was supposed to. <laughs> All right, here's that weapons bag, a silencer and an ergonomic grip. Uh, is this fully modded? I think so, yeah. Um, let's see. I don't want the pipe rifle. I don't want that, that. I'm going to keep those jars in case we, I got plenty of scrap wire. Come across some more of those, uh, uh, mineral water, you know, thingies. Uh, what was I doing? I was looking for, uh, I was looking, I'm come, I just lost my whole entire train of thought. I was doing something. Can't remember what it was now. We were checking something. <laughs> oh, we were checking to see if uh, this was was fully modded, um, which uh, it is. Okay. Let us proceed. I think that's how we get up to the next floor. And we came through there uh, from the get-go. We can't get to that bag. Behind here. Don't see anything else in this room. Any wall safes in the courtroom? No, but there's a weapons bag on the witness stand. <laughs> Go figure. Uh, okay, I guess we'll take that. Is this the judge's chambers? Could be a wall safe in here. Nope. All right. Oh, that's not the witnesses stand. That's the judge's platform. Okay, there's Koparuski in there. Um, okay, so we came out that way. Is there something up here? I don't think so. At least not from this side. No, I don't want that. Um, yeah, ammunition. I'm not gonna open that up. Metal detectors. <laughs> beep 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 beep. We've got so much iron on us, you know. It was bound to happen. Okay, before we go that direction, let's just look in here. I'm gonna leave all. The, well, actually, I'm not gonna leave the the cans. I really need cans. Need them to make the oil to then make the molotovs and other things that we need oil for. 
Uh, that and that. And actually, we'll take that to get more mineral water. Okay. coming next. Take all that. Kitchen. Three charges. Lots of mineral water in the courthouse, ladies and gentlemen. And we picked up, uh, yeah, one of these here. Okay, let's, um, let's eat that tasty cat food that's 200 years old. Gotta love it. And this we need for tuna fish gravy, so I don't really want to eat that at the moment. Get rid of that and that. Okay, I'm not going to check all these cupboards. Make sure everybody's loaded here. That door is blocked. Let's go check in here. More research data, yay. That's what we want. Ooh, I'll take both of those. Guess that's it for in here. Okay, since uh, nighttime is uh, just about upon us, let's break this down so we don't have to worry about outside zombies getting to us. And we'll trap ourselves up here. <laughs> Not that I'm worried about that. I'll take that, that, and that. <clears throat> Don't want any of that stuff. Let's open the desk. No, normally I'd take that, but it's not, not something we're going to do this time. I know it's worth some money, but we have to be selective. Some bullets. That one's locked, too. Everything's locked, man. What the heck? Nope. Don't need a bone. Got that guy over there. Let's go into this room first, though. Another book. <clears throat> okay, he must be in that room there. So what I'm going to do is let's run back where we have a nice clear sniping shot of him. Uh-oh. 
don't. This guy's gonna be tough. Love that slowing effect. Oop. Screen freeze. More bookshelves. Scrap sledgehammer. Nope. We're scrapping the scrap sledgehammer. All right, we're picking up some research data, guys. It's coming together. Sure, why not? Guess we should check all these pictures here. That's probably to parkour down and get that duffel bag, which I don't think I will do, because duffel bags usually don't have anything worth the effort in them. was an ambush, if ever I have been a victim of one. Alright. I'm going to put these spike traps down on our toolbar. And let's take a bandage. And a mineral water. Marlene, you could have just gone around. You're so dumb. More books. <coughs> she got a final hit off on us. Oh, and we got a friggin' abrasion now um dysentery medicine oh right because i drank that goldenrod i was gonna say why do i have dysentery medicine let's pop one of these to fix the abrasion or reduce it anyway and we're good There's a duffel bag that we can't quite get to. There we go. Oh, there we go. Um, I guess I'll take those. I don't care about that dirty water. Now for the fun part. Um, I'm just trying to think of a good tactic to use here for these guys. <clears throat> Why don't we do this? The window sills are going to... Ouch. Yeah, let's not do that. Okay. Some of those in there. Um, <clears throat> they might try and break out the other side, but that's okay. As long as we can just slow them down enough to 
to kill him, is the thing. They might try and jump up on this mattress here. On this side. That corner should be reasonably protected. Okay, let's make sure we're fully loaded. Let's wake him up. I was expecting a lot more zombos than that. There's got to be more up there. Seriously? That's it? I thought like a whole crap ton of Zeke's dropped down from that roof. Okay. Um... I guess that's it. Watch me be wrong about that, and we'll get inside and I'm trying to break this glass here. Oh, well, I thought the this would collapse with it. Why can't I hit that? There we go. All right, let's get whoops. Let's get this ready. Just in case. Zombos? Nope, I guess not. Okay. That was a little bit uh, anticlimactic. Uh, there's a duffel bag up there that we can nerd pull up to, I suppose. Why not? We might as well. It's up there. Yeah, that was worth it. Let's go all the way up into the attic and take a peek here. Yeah, there's nothing else up there. Okay. The last time I did this POI, which is quite a long time ago, um, there was a lot more zombies that came out of that attic than what we saw here. Um, let's loot. Oh, you know what? Let's also take one of these. Might as well. <clears throat> Maybe we'll get some food in here that we can eat immediately. Uh, like that, for example. Nice. We were just talking about blueberry pie earlier. Copper there. All right, let's open this guy up. Most of our locks in this episode have been on the have been on, on the counterclockwise side. Oh, there we go. Uh, go, rather. Steven's treasure map is a good one to have. The rest of that stuff is, eh, not that great. It's okay, though. You know, I can't complain, though. I mean, we got a S-level spash shotgun in this episode. That is phantasmagorical. All right, you guys. I think I'm going to go ahead and wrap up the episode here, and I'm just going to actually hunker down here in the top of the courthouse, and then when we start up the next episode, which, remember, will be... Um, 
not till I get back from my trip um, around May 8th, May 9th or so, uh, then we will resume uh, at that point, unless Fun Pimps have released Alpha 21, in which case we will start Alpha 21. I probably will go ahead and play Experimental Branch too. Um, so yeah, that is the, the tentative plan at this point in time. So thanks everybody for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment, share out the video. And we'll catch y'all in a little over a week from now. Bye-bye.